is an appear case. Here, this extern is a storage class case. This extern is what case, sir? Storage class, sir. Wait a second. Storage class. This extern is what? Storage class. What is this integer? What is this integer? Is a return type. It is a return type. Function no. This is function no. This is what is this one? This one is what? Function name. All right, like a mean, like a mean, right? And this is what is return type, right? And this is what the parenthesis is. This is what it is, parenthesis is. How many arguments you have it? You have two arguments. From here to here. From here to here, one argument. And here it is one argument, right? Now, what is this one is? Constant is a keyword. Then it makes a constant. Character is a data type. Star is a pointer. This one, this one is a variable. Here to here, it is what? A variable. This is a variable, normal variable. You write it A, B, C, D, no? Same like this, variable, underscore restrict format. That's all it is. What is the meaning of this one? This one will I will teach you in your future. But what is the meaning of this one? This one means what? String data type. It is expecting what? String data type. Anything with a string here, right? means anything with a double inverted commas. For example, when I pass, at that time when I pass MIPWeb, when I pass MIPWeb, there was no error. Right? When I pass MIPWeb, there was no error at all. But when did, when I passed, when I passed what? I, you are getting a, you are getting a warning now here. Why? Because it is expecting string here, but you are giving what? Integer here. That is what the warning it is giving. Understood? And this one I will explain when the, when the pointer concept is coming. Okay? What is it? Why, why, why that warning was coming? It was expecting string here. It was expecting string here, but what I'm passing it here, I'm passing integer here. Right? That is what it is. Again, I'll tell you, constant is just a keyword, which makes the constant and teleport. Constant means you cannot change it. That is what the constant is. Character is a data type. Star is a pointer. This is just a variable name. Like A, B, C, D, whatever you have, right? That's like that. What is the meaning of entire thing? Is a string type. Anything with a double unit commas, it will accept it. When I give MIPBAB, it was not getting any error. So what happened? Any warning? What happened now? Warning. It is expecting string, but what I'm giving is I'm giving i. That is the reason it is telling. Oh, you have converted this one integer without casting that is everything. Now you have three dots. What is this three dots? Three dots. It's called as ellipse. What is this called as ellipse? E L E I P S something ellipse. It has it. Uh, what is this ellipse? Ellipse tells that after this, after this, it's your option. You can pass either zero to n number of arguments. To achieve this one, you will use it for three dots. It's a huge concept, guys. When I am free, I will. If, I, if the time is available, I will explain that. You have separate header file called a uh, ARGS something called as like that, right? So using that, you will be using that. In entire language, you use it. In um, C also you use it, C++ also use it, Java also use it. Everywhere you use it, okay? Next call is what? Ellipse. Why I'm using this one? Because in a printf, I don't know how many arguments I'll be passing it. In a printf, look on your case, you can pass A, comma B, comma C, comma D, comma E, or E, comma F. How does it shoot? By this one only, three dots only. Once after the function topic is done, once after all this topic is done, I'll explain that this ellipse thing, okay? I'm closing parenthesis and semicolon end of the statement. Entire thing is called as this entire thing is called as this entire thing is called as function declaration. What is this called as function declaration? Okay, entire thing is called as what function declaration. Right on this case in storage class. Right, right now, I'll tell you in storage class, you have four things one is extra, one is extra. Other one is a register, a register, other one is auto, okay, auto, other one is static. Other one is static. These four things are there. When the storage class topic comes, I'll tell you. Take it, take down this one, take down this one, take down this one, take down this one. Okay. Now, how to fix this problem now? How to fix this problem now? Simple thing, guys. I can fix it in some so, so many ways. The first thing I wanted is it was string. First thing was string. String means anything enclosed with double inverted commas. And then comma, then I want to print i. Since I am printing i here, I want to tell which type of data it is. Which type of data it is? Integer type of data. What is the format space for integer percentage d? That is why I'm going to be printing it. And I will run this program. 
and I run this program, my problem is solved. That's all it is. So first argument, it will accept what string type. Second, it can be anything. It can be integer, character, float, double, whatever you wanted, you can do it. How many ever you can pass it? Zero or how many ever? Right? If you are not passing, also fine. If you're passing 100 also, you can pass it 100 also. Who is achieving this? By three dots. That is called as what? Ellipse. That is called as what? Ellipse. Right?